Good everybody, it's your boy right here, man, Black Pill Steph. Welcome to another Black Pill Steph reaction, Red Pill content video. If you're new to the family, you're new to the movement, make sure you hit that like button. Comment below, man, more videos you want me to react to as well. If you got any questions or concerns and DMs or any relationship advice, make sure you hit, my, um, hit me on my Instagram. It'll be in the description box below. As well, make sure you hit that big red subscribe button. Click that post notification bell to get the latest updates and alerts when I'm dropping a video because I got y'all every single time. In today's video, man, we are reacting to a video that I found on IG again. Uh, it is called um, Alpha Woman or is, there such, uh, or is there such thing as an alpha woman? Today I went live on my Instagram, kind of gave a little brief synopsis about what it is, but I'm going in depth further than today. So without further ado, let's get into the video, man. Let's get it, man. Let go. You want you an alpha man? You want an alpha female, right? No. No such thing. Oh, my God. No, I don't. <laughs> there's no such thing as an alpha female? Yeah, there's no such thing as an alpha female. There's no such thing. Why? How? Why do you think that? Who does mm. she lead? In the relationship. Who does she lead as an no, alpha female? No, as a, as a person, though. Not in the relationship. As she a person. Mm, okay. Okay, okay, so in terms start. of relationship, if you're an alpha female, mm. who are you leading? You're the alpha. So you lead people, yeah, right? Yeah. There can uh, there can be a dynamic though. There can where, be two alphas. No, where there's a man who's you know what I'm saying submissive to the woman. Uh, excuse me. Say that again. Uh, a man who's submissive to the woman. Okay. Yes. So how do you feel about that man that's well, submissive to you? Me personally, I can't be with nobody <laughs> that's gonna be submissive to me because okay. I'm gonna walk okay. all over all right. him. Exactly. That's just me personally though. Some women want somebody that's submissive. You, you know what's crazy? All right. Did y'all catch that right? Did y'all catch the end of what she said? She, she, an alpha female wants somebody to be submissive. She wants a man to be submissive to her. And when they asked her the question, they were like, okay, how do you feel about that? Oh, I don't want no man submissive to me. I'm going to walk all over him like a doormat. We're going to watch this time. For the new church member and the congregation members of the Black Pill Steph family, welcome to the Black Pill Church. If y'all, if y'all hear this message again, we're going to play the video one more time. Y'all ready? Let's get it, man. Let go. You want you an alpha man? You want an alpha female, right? No. No such thing. Oh, my God. No, I don't. <laughs> there's no such thing as an alpha female? Yeah, there's no such thing as an alpha yeah, female. No such thing. Why? How? Why do you think that? Who does she lead? In the relationship. Who does she lead? As an no, alpha as female? No, as a person, though. Not in the relationship. As she a person. Mm, okay. Okay, okay, so in terms start. of relationship, if you're an alpha female, who are you leading? You're the alpha. So you lead people, yeah. right? Yeah. Right. There can't uh, there can be a dynamic though. There can where, be two alphas. No, where there's a man who's you know what I'm saying submissive to the woman. Uh, excuse me. Say that again. Uh, a man who's submissive to the woman. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yes. So how do you what? feel about that man that's well, submissive to you? Me personally, I can't <laughs> be with nobody that's gonna be submissive to me because okay. I'm gonna walk okay. all over all right. him. Exactly. That's just me personally though. Some women want somebody that's you, submissive. You know what's crazy. All right, man, so we're going to jump right into the topic right now. If you actually saw it, I had to replay it for those who just walked in the church and didn't even see it. So we're talking about alpha female. So when I did my research, I found two different definitions of alpha female. I got one off of Urban Dictionary and the other one off of, Wix I guess it's Wiktionary. It's pretty much the same thing, but I'm going to read them to you anyway. And I'm going to put them on the screen as well while we're reading it. Urban Dictionary, a powerful, assertive woman. Confidence may be due to her good looks with superior intelligence. Men desire her. Cap. Cap. <laughs> <laughs> Girls with low self-esteem hate her. I'm going to read it again. Urban Dictionary for the definition of an alpha female goes like this. A powerful, assertive woman. Confidence may be due to her good looks, superior intelligence. Men desire her. Girls with low esteem hate her. Wiktionary definition. The dominant female in a social or group hierarchy. The dominant female in a social or group hierarchy. This brings me back to a movie with Regina Hall. Um, I can't think of the little mama's name off of... Uh, Blackish, I think it's is it Marzini Martin? She's off of the new uh, Paramount Plus movie with Amari Hardwick, the new family movie where her, she plays it, whatever. But get back on topic. In Little, Regina Hall character and the, the other character, it was about a, a female who was pretty much 
prime alpha. Got out the mud, got it herself. Had, you know, she's the she owns her own business. Up there with COOs, have high end clientele, all that. You could say she could be a high value woman, right? So she would do all these things that she thinks that men actually desired her when she had a young boy lover. And, and she used to walk over the middle class and lower class people because she thought she was better than them because how she was treated in her past life. So pe- so to get on it, they said girls with low self-esteem hate her. Now as well, let me get let me get let me put the other co-star in there, Issa Ray, who played her assistant. You saw how in the movie Little, how Regina Hall would treat people, men who wasn't on her level, as well women with low self-esteem as well low property value level how she would treat them because she was up to, she was a creme de la creme on a, on a different on a different scale and a different percentage of women right so let's let's we're gonna go on to this as well into the into another thing that alpha females have alpha females have that had to find a difference between the two the strengths of an alpha female ability to lead strong outspoken you can say that's every woman, you know, hear me roar, the feminism, the feminists, everything like that to, to be outspoken, which they barely truly are. Every woman is very outspoken. You're going you're gonna to hear what they have to say. One thing for sure, two things for certain. You're going to hear what they're going to say. They're very outspoken. You know what I'm saying? Strong. Once again, every woman think they strong because they carry all this so-called burden on their back. Since the feminism was, since feminism has been introduced into this Western modern world of America, as well as the ability to lead. Some women have ability to lead, some women don't. And the stories that I could find that women think they could be leaders but actually end up crashing that company or crashing the group that they're with or breaking the whole group up is bar, is pretty much bar to none. But this is the emphasis on this. Check this out though. A weakness of an alpha female. Now you're gonna say to yourself, Black Pill, what are you talking about? Uh, alpha female don't have no weakness Everybody has a weakness That's why it's called sh- strengths and weaknesses That's why when people get with each other in relationships I have strengths You have weaknesses That we can co- that we can compare and reflect off each other You have strengths I have weaknesses that you're strong in That I'm weak in That I'm strong in and you're weak in And once again we can compel each other And reflect each other and help each other Get those strengths from each other But this is what the thing This is the thing about This is the thing about the weaknesses of uh, in an alpha female being vulnerable. Alpha females usually don't like to use their, use like put pretty much don't like use their emotion. Now you always hear the old saying, "A woman wear the heart on her sleeve," or any person wear a heart on sleeve. Usually nine times out of nine times out of ten, women wear their heart on their sleeve. They're emotional creatures. So of course, so of course, a woman who was a high value woman or an alpha female doesn't want to show that typical side of that vulnerability because they think if they show that side, people will take that for a weakness and the saying goes, don't take my kindness for weakness. So that's why I, that's why alpha female who is strong, hear me roar, have the ability to be outspoken, has to put that guard up like a maximum security prison to protect everybody from around them who they truly are on the inside. So from the outside, how we looking, you may be hard, you may be guarded, you may be hard as steel, tough as nails, all that stuff. But the moment you you even suspect a tick of vulnerability, that's when you think people are gonna take advantage of you. That's why alpha females hate the word submissiveness. Even in their present, they don't think they should be submissive because all the hard work they have been through, all the hard work they have gone through, all the work they have done to get to the place where it is now. But guess what? There's a lot of women in today's world who wants to be in your shoes, who are very vulnerable and has been outspoken. But guess what? They still be submissive and they let people in, they let people in their feelings. And it has led them to a, to a great deal of a life of success. If you want to be this hardcore female, this hardcore rapper, this raunchy, masculine female, you're going to be by yourself. But then I asked myself, I asked myself, what do, what do alpha, what do, who do, who do, who does, who do alpha females look for in a relationship? And they say they look for alpha male. And I actually looked at it and I was like, do alpha males want alpha females? And when I researched it, they said alpha females want the opposite of an alpha female. Alpha males, I'm sorry, 
Alpha males want the opposite of alpha females. They want somebody who's feminine. Now, I just gave you the definition that a, 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 a alpha female is powerful, assertive, strong, outspoken. Is that feminine? But they speak about I want to be I want to be traditional. I want to I want to be able to pay significant bills. I don't want to pay significant bills. I want to be taken care of. I want to be just a typical wife that could take care of the house of kids. Let me let me. It's kind of getting hot out here. Let me roll my car up real quick. You know they 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 want they still want to be taken care of, but they still want to keep that role. Well, baby, you, baby, two alphas blacked in this video. Two alphas cannot lead the pack. You don't see two alphas leading a pride alliance. You don't see two alphas leading a pack of wolves. You don't see two alphas leading a herd of cow. It's only can be one and one only. And I just gave it to you that an alpha male is not looking for the complete same person of an alpha female that throws the balance off. So and then I looked at it. What in relationships do alpha females bring? And they said this. They think they're they think number one, they think they're sought off, sought after. And I asked myself, sought after who? You got typical blue collar guys, blue worker guys that really want to be with these women. But if you don't live up to the certain salary level or impeccable level of social level, they're not gonna be with you. Two, career driven very ambitious always got the bag on their mind always making moves always making moves which is a good thing but if you think about money in your career all the time who do you have time for you can say men lie and women lie but money don't yeah money don't lie but being alone is really gonna where you're gonna be at if you're so self-sufficient if you're so ambitious career driven and, and, and getting that chicken bag up Two, yearning to learn. I met many out females who are willing to learn, but they're willing to learn what? I could give you the game on certain new business avenues and this and, and, and that that and the third. But sometimes I see now females take that knowledge and use it against their own people that taught them to get to the top. So they can be the only one at the top because it says it's lonely at the top. As well, once again, I said self-defense and independence. I-N-D-E-P-E-N-E-N-T. -E 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 Do you know what that means? Fund them in that alpha female, that people think alpha females is the way to go. It's like the post I did with the woman yesterday on fit, fret, uh, Fresh and Fit podcast clips. And Myra answered that question about how, you know, you put so much money towards your man, but you don't get support so long. Alpha females only stick around in relationships so long because if you don't meet that social status in a certain time, they cut you off. But they want to be treated equal in a traditional partner. But sometimes, as a, as, at a social at a social high, sometimes men men can't catch up to an alpha female. I, I see in my comments all the time. Well, you know, my, my my wife makes more than me, and she you know, and she does this and she does. I said, but she does she still treat you as your partner? They say yes, but I I, I don't live in their relationship. I don't live in their house. Last time I checked, 70% of divorce are initiated by women. So some so if they're if you marry to an alpha woman, some kind of social, some kind of social level has to come from that relationship. If you don't meet that, you don't meet that criteria, you're done. You're cut off. Venito. Adios. Deuces. It's a wrap. That's what most alpha females think they do. But then I had to flip it to the other side and let's well, well, since I think I'm bashing, let's get to the alpha male side. Let's get to the alpha male. Cause you know, people think I just bash female. Let me get to the alpha male side. The alpha male is pretty much the same as the alpha female. The most dominant role male in a particular group of a social hierarchy. Highly intelligent, confident, and successful. Ain't that what alpha female is? She's highly confident herself in her looks. She is very confident. She is very confident. She is very successful. She is very educated. The same thing alpha female as alpha male is, right? So let me see what relation, let me see what roles relationship that alpha male plays. He's a leader. He's not controlling. 
very all right y'all hold on let me uh turn off my camera because it's getting overheated all right man i'm back man i had to get that camera i had to get that camera cool down for a little bit um let me let me get back into it man so in today's video in the rest of the video i'm doing the alpha male last time i left off was they were opposite of an alpha female highly intelligent very confident and successful then i asked what was the leadership roles for alpha uh for alpha for alpha males they're leaders so you know they because you know women want to lead women want man women alpha females or females or women in general around this world they want men to lead the relationship they want them to take charge they want them to be the first and deciding factor the decision of growing their family finances and everything yes we will in, we will pretty much take your input of what we're trying to do but at the end of the day you know everybody says it that that their mate their spouse their partner is the last deciding factor of what decision of that household or relationship is going to be secondly they're not controlling i haven't met too many alpha males that are not controlling but they are very territorial um because you know it's an alpha male we men look at the hierarchy of freaking animals from lions wolves tigers hell snakes hippos whatever dogs you know they're very territorial and then we we can say we can do that that's why in some instances when people ask you looked at the godfather rest of the soul myron on fresh and fit steph is cold myron uh mtr pearls they ask you know if you had an alpha male who was a top one to five percent earner you do realize you're gonna have to share them because an alpha male or a top alpha a, a, a top earner in this world is not one to be single he's gonna want multiple women probably a wife girlfriend a mistress whatever have multiple pieces that's why the video I posted yesterday with Kevin Samuels, women, can you handle can you handle being a side piece? Especially to a high value man, a high, a high earner, a hindrance. A lot of people, a lot of women said no. They can't handle that. They want to be the only main prize in that man's life. Which is that brings me to another one. Very open about what they want, what they want to mate. Pretty much they want to like i said in the last like i said early prior before without females they want a woman who is very very feminine as well they don't wait for a potential mate to approach them to shoot they shot so a man so an alpha male is not if he sees something he wants but which brings that territorial kind of that territorial energy they're going to shoot that shot with that opposite sex the opposite sex she look good she's fit she's feminine she's beautiful confident sort of everything he's gonna shoot that shot to see if he can if he can land that and bag that and if he does hey all guns blazing because you know he's gonna he's gonna try he's probably gonna <laughs> try to end up make a relationship probably try to make a baby with her and everything like that and uh that's where we're going that's where it's gonna be at man that you know that's where i want to come with the alpha female and the alpha male type of type of uh definition man um about what it says with the video, man, that, you know, two alphas can't lead. It's gonna have to be one. You see, the, the, uh, the succession rate, which I don't have, I try to look it up everywhere, of the of the succession rate of an alpha female relationship, but I know it's very low. Um, once once I, I mentioned before, women are initiating divorce 70% of the time. 30% of women are getting married and staying married. So like I said, 70% are the single, childless, fatherless everything so with that that's how we developed the whole uh independent woman don't need a man for nothing i could be on my own i could do that all by my damn self all that notion which is which is the problem which is why i came up with the alpha female uh topic of yes they they are very very confident very intelligent very good looking they say women hate on their good looks they can't really attract, they try to attract certain things that they want. Ooh, this is getting ridiculous. All right, y'all, one last break, I promise. This is probably gonna be halftime because my camera's overheating again. Give me one more, I promise. One more, hold on. All right, y'all, boss, sorry for the, strong, for the long delay break. I had to literally let my phone literally charge, literally cool down because it was hot. I was in the sun, so I guess the sun heated up since I've been in the shade. But without further ado, man, if you like this video, what I described, what alpha female was, description to an alpha male with the differences, and do us men like it, make sure you hit that like button, comment below, 
as well hit that big red subscribe button as well in the comments section below man uh do you agree with the alpha female and the alpha male mindset do you believe that an alpha female and an alpha male can coexist do you believe that an alpha male should turn it off when she meets her alpha male and be traditional and be feminine while she's with an alpha male do you believe that an alpha female should not turn off her personality and still be her in the relationship that an alpha female can still be feminine but remember two alphas cannot lead but if, if you agree with it just uh if you agree with it just let me know in the comment section below as well let me know if you want to do anything else topics that's been on your mind racing that you want to get out as well you can dm me on my instagram as well i did create a patreon it hasn't been set up yet but i'm gonna make i'm gonna make it i'm making my patreon account uh for more cold topics that i can't discuss on uh youtube or instagram that'll be on patreon make sure you like comment subscribe until next time family welcome to the black pill step family matrix Let's escape it together and make this money and create generational wealth. You're taking the red pill, you're taking the blue pill. Till next time. Peace. Bro, told y'all be down south with